Hello everyone and welcome to Algerian Youth Voice, Alwad. This is a new episode of your Changemakers Radio Show. This is Sadiq, your host, and we are going to a very special guest today, Khalif al Aib and Anis Haddana from the Alwad Young Leaders for Change Association. And they are going to tell us more about their team, their activities, their experiences, and the impact they have on, they have on their community and especially their peers. Hello Khalifa, hello Anis. We are really pleased to have you all with, with us today. Hello Sadaq, and thank you very much for inviting me. I really feel excited right now. Yes, hello Sadaq. I'm really overwhelmed. I can't find the word to describe how it feels. Yeah. Uh, it's our pl- privilege to talk to you. So please, can you tell us more about the EYLC Association? Well, it all began when you were an access student. And at the end of this program, we thought of something that can keep us all together. And many of us agreed to create an association where we can all meet and work together. And the EYLC was founded just to tell the other, find out what they are able to do. because. Uh, when we are access student, there were uh, like some activities and workshops which really helped us to uh, learn more about us and ourselves and develop our skills and uh, become so so social active. Yeah, mm-hmm. all the association members met on a regular basis and discuss its goals and the activities that uh, that we can do, spread the idea of volunteering and helping the others. Mm, what activities that your association took part in? Well, actually, we wanted like something different because we thought of changing the way people think. Yeah, and uh, yeah, we thought of yeah. uh, helping uh, young people discover yeah. themselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, we agreed to have those kids who lives in Fula Musafa because they don't even have the chance to uh, go to schools. So that was exactly what we wanted: taking schools to them. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. I think our listeners are more eager to know about this experience. Yeah. Can you share more, please? We planned for uh, some activities and we share uh, roles so that uh, everyone can participate and make it a success. Yes, like earlier, like Khalifa said, we wanted to be a huge success because we needed a strong push forward. Mm, and what kind of activities did you do with the kids? Can you be more specific? Well, some of us taught the languages, French, English and Arabic, and the other taught the drawing and the math and all that stuff. And I did dance, that was awesome. Yeah, Khalifa, you remember that? The kids loved that, they loved it. They had a great time dancing with Khalifa, he's a great, great dancer. I just want to be with you and participate in some of your activities. I feel so excited about that. Yeah, yeah. We, we also did uh, some games to the kids uh, and that helped them feel more comfortable and uh, extrovert. Even the, the director himself asked us to, to come and have uh, more time with the kids. They liked that a lot and they was asking about us all the time. And what did you do about that? I mean, when they asked you to go there and more and have time with them? Uh, we scheduled a weekly meeting with them. Yes, we went there like uh, twice a week before we started studying in the secondary school in, in September. We feel uh, so bad uh, not being able to go there yeah. so often because we are having our back exams yeah, this yeah. year and we need to focus on our, uh, more in, on our uh, studies. Yeah. I really thank you for, for this initi- initiative. <laughs> you are bringing to our city and empowering the youth and making them realize mm-hmm. what they are capable of. It's a duty towards our society, not only the people who live there. Sure, uh, this is the, the least we can do to help uh, to help others change and bring change and uh, and bring out the best in them. I really appreciate your coming today, and I hope we can have have you more and more in our city. Thanks. Sadiq. Yes, uh, thank you, Sadiq. Any time. <laughs> and now back to our listeners. If you are doing great things, please let us know that was all for today's podcast. You are listening to Algerian Youth Voice from Elwad. Thank you for listening.